All right, so I decided to do a little VOD review, and hopefully it helps you out. This is from whatever you uploaded against my room. All right, there we go. I haven't well, watched yeah, it. Yeah, like, I do. This is the first actually a requirement. Do you now? Prepare your defenses. Yeah, let's do, uh... Select your hero. Let's go there. you, Lamau. I'm sorry, I'm not. I'm two. Six ways. So, how was it, PG? One second, I mean, mute in game. Um, it was alright. I just got some like a war thingy, my bobber, and I'm just like, alright, peace. So, like, as soon as the game starts, you should be calling what people are playing. Like, obviously, here it doesn't really matter because you know it's what we always run, but on other maps, as soon as the map you know starts, the first thing you should be saying is, okay, we play this, 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 and this, and then people can chat about whatever they want. It should just be structured and easier that way. Nice. Yeah, I got home exactly. The hut. There's like. I mean, like hug doesn't even see playing. Controversial. He has. That's why he gets changed in every fucking patch. People don't like being able to die because he hits one ability on you, which I think is kind of fair. But at the same time. Okay, here if you want, you can go all the way to their spawn and place three turrets on top of it. I mean, sometimes they see it, sometimes they don't, but if they do not see it and run through, you get like, I don't know, more than 30% charge, which is, which is totally worth it. But like, this is okay for turrets as well. That works. People don't like don't pressing you... their fucking S button. I was gonna say, you just need to like, you can play around cooldowns. I had, I had a whole argument in another Discord with a guy about it, who was saying he's OP. It's usually people that are bad. Um, that... Okay, I'm gonna go back so I can show you some spots that you should be putting putting turrets up. At. Uh, hopefully this pen thing works. So let me see. You can play. Okay, so right here, you should be putting it on the. Oh shit! It doesn't work on the fucking video. Fuck, man. Hold on. That's interesting. Oh, because that's the racer tool. Oh my god. Okay, one second. So, you should be putting a third right here on the front card. Because the way you put it down in front of the card you can actually see it and like it's not gonna do a lot of damage it's not a big deal but like you should always be putting turrets where they do max amount of damage so that you can get charged faster play around cooldowns i had i had a whole argument and then i discord with a guy about it who was saying he's open and then oh man you don't even go through there so i can't show you the spot let me see if I can do this. Okay, this is perfect. So one third spot is right... Oh shit. This is the perfect spot. You can put it underneath. And like they actually have to spend some time looking for it. And meanwhile you're getting your uh, charge. Another spot is inside right here. So if they go main, that that, that will give you probably 20% charge by the time they get the turrets. And then the sixth one, because you put three in their spawn, right? This is fourth, this is fifth. And then last one can be either here or somewhere around this area. Like it's up to you. That's the sixth turret right there. Right here. Like, Hog doesn't even see play anymore. Hog is like really like controversial. He has, that's why he gets changed in every fucking patch. People don't like being able to die because he. And they're the ones usually with the loudest voice, so. I wouldn't say bad, it's bad position. Oh, okay, you did that. Uh, a lot of people that complain about it. Okay, here, the best spots are right here in this corner. 
and then right here in this corner because they actually have to turn the main corner and go onto the point in order to get them and you know the horses are in shit spots that they can get picked off of the way you put them so you put them here right uh you put them i think right here and then on the far right like they can see them from main they can just destroy them real quick and they don't they don't do much like they just die that's why those spots are not good Yeah. On the forums are like silver players anyway, yeah. As a stay with the Actually, like that last spot he did. Oh another really really good one, because it gets top and main is one right here. Oh man, I keep using the wrong color. So green is good, red is not so good. Like a third right here is really good because it gets people trying to peek up top. And also gets people main, and it gets people coming to the wall. It's it's just a really nice spot. But like I'd say, have one here, one here, or like three, but like three at most, not not more than that. You don't need more than three because they'll just get destroyed all at the same time. Okay, I'm gonna be stopping and like going over stuff because you know i think it's important because i mean it seems simple and not that important but um like i just i don't know like you have to get used to doing this shit and you know doing it a little bit better so for example the shield you just used here like that's not needed you just wasted it uh, against a good team they'll say okay uh symmetra doesn't have a shield just push now and like kill her so that's that. That's not a good use of the shield. Like you have to make him spam you. Like you don't even have to use the shield. You can just put your turrets up and whatever. But like if they are on you or focusing you, like force him to spam you and like exactly when the rock is about to hit you, just put the shield up and you block damage for free that way. You know, but don't just use it like this. Like this doesn't block anything. It's just you know it's a one second of inconvenience for them. It's not a big deal. I did not warm up before this game. That's a good spot. There. Nice. I like that one. She's one. They're up top. They're all over. I mean, I talked about it. Like, the, the shield is not needed. Like, you're not covering anything. It's just... Like, you're throwing it like, like spam, but you don't, you don't have to do that. It's not necessary. Shields up, HP. Go back to boxes. Nice one, nice one. Nice. nice, good job. Hey, cook. Monkey dropped. Right. I'm trying to shield right now. That turret spot right there is just not good because they can see it from everywhere. It's just a free turret kill. You know, they should be always on, on like some kind of corners. So when they turn, they either have to choose whether to shoot the turrets or people. You know, they have to be turning around. But that spot is just like they run forward. And they just shoot it, it's just, that's why it's not that good. Um, I mean, these are just turret spots, you know, you can fix that right up away. Here. That's the right now. Right. What's our half? Alright, I have all turrets up. I like What's, uh, me? What are all turrets now? There's two things. But right. again, it's, it's kind of easy to destroy. We have the visor when you get it. Or not, don't, not. I mean, they don't have any. I just went back right. to show you where I like to put my turrets. We have the visor because... when you get it. Or not, don't. Not, I mean, they don't have any. Okay, I just put one right here. Like, uh, on the side of this box. Because if they dive you, then they have to shoot this one right here. They have to shoot this one. And then I also put one on the card. So they kind of have to, you know, rotate three times to get all the turrets. And in the meantime, you're just shitting on them. That's how I like to do it. Because if they dive, you know, people just fall back to this area right here. And your turrets are just destroying them. You can even put two right here. And, like, if you notice when I used to play, I would tell you, like, come to me if they dive you. Because if you just drop down, like, I'll probably kill someone just with my turrets. Because the spots are really good. Okay. Yeah, what's the 
Who should have Who should have Drop, 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 you're not making a decision yourself. Like Monkey Dove above you, you did not go for him. Lucy was going main, you just peeked him, shot him for a second, then went back. Then someone else came, and then you were confused again. And like against a good team, you don't have that much time. Like in those three, four seconds, you would have been dead already for free without even, you know, doing something. I would say either hide and went, wait for someone to, you know, run past you so you can actually left click him and kill him. Or you can go upstairs and help with the Winston. Assuming the Winston is not looking at you, you can melt Winston's with Symmetra. You can melt anything, really. But if Winston is not looking at you, you can destroy him. The moment he looks at you, you should probably just, you know, run away and go to your turrets. But I definitely did not like this because you were just not helping anyone and you were just hiding. You could have helped a little bit more. I'm not going. I'm not saying go all in. You need to die for no reason. But you could have helped a little bit more. Monkey one, monkey, monkey one, low, monkey low. You go one, you go one, you go one. Triple. Try to do. Where's the dead? Help me, help me, guys. You lost mine. Come in, I'm coming. I'm putting up. It was out of make me end. It was out of make me end. Soldier going back up top. I have Shelly. Don't come with me. Yes, Diva, so Diva behind, Diva behind. Uh, I mean, she's way too far. Like, Hold on, I got it, I got it. I got it. I got it. Who's here? Is it? Someone kill I'll get it, I'll get it. Alright, nice. Did you take my. Fuck you! My sentry was destroyed. There we go. I got Tally still. I'm gonna stay back. I'm not gonna be able to. I'm just gonna get ready to put it down. That's a good call. Like, whenever you have it, you should just stay back and try to play like even i'd say place turrets because you know it's free like why not put two more turrets down like right now so when they dive you can actually you know maybe even kill someone because they're free right you get them recharged so why not Clever one HP. I need a V helix. Alright, I'm close to shatter. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna push. 98. They're going upper. I have shatter now. Alright, I'm gonna get uh, to it. So they're going right, upper. They're all upper now. They're all upper. Except for Ryan. Uh, bro, what the fuck? They're going for a turret, dude. I'm gonna play boxes. They're gonna get the turret. And at least you see me up here? Uh, this guy right now, I'm boosting my call for it. Look for it as soon as the line drops. Okay, so what I do not like is that you've had two turrets for free for such a long while now. Like, just put them down somewhere, try to help your team. Like, maybe even go where, like, the spots I showed you and just, you know, stack four turrets there. Like, why not? Like, just put them down. It's free, you should be using them the whole time. It shields well. Alright, shoot it. Alright, that's around. It's a good chatter. Rainer, 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 can I lose you? Tell isn't Gatorade. I got the shield, got the shield, got the shield. That's not Gatorade there, that's Graveyard or whatever. Gatorade is right above you. Tell isn't Graveyard, so. I no, said Graveyard, never mind. Fuck me. They know where it is, they're probably gonna go for it. The Tell is in Graveyard, you said? Yeah, it's in Graveyard, there's only four right. left. There's only we'll four we'll left. Cover it. Let's find the turret. Alright, it's not spot, guys. They're gonna Result be fighting on point. They're not gonna be. Uh, they're not gonna be I'm on dead here. Soldier half. I'm dead. Alright, rip. You on the charge? Oh, you still have one free turret that you haven't used. Like I already mentioned that, but that's really important. Like you have to have all the turrets down. So just make sure next time you play some entry, you have all the turrets down at all times, unless you know they're gonna be pushing 
if you have a lot there's main and you know they're gonna be pushing uh, back alley then you can wait a little bit to see if they actually push there so you can switch your turrets around but otherwise you should have all of them down the whole time I have three full charge Charging rain, I stood I'm down I'm coming to TP Who should it? Ryan's gonna shatter Third Ryan dead Oh, like <laughs> This is, this is a huge mess. You stop to put a turret up? Like, I understand, like, you want that damage from the turrets, but, like, you building your left click is actually probably, I don't know, six, seven times better than you uh, putting turrets down, right? So, in situations like that where you have someone in your face, just fucking hold left click. You don't even have to think about it. The moment you kill him, then you can probably put a turret or two, but. You p could have probably gotten that ran to like, I don't know, one third, maybe even kill them. No, you wouldn't have killed them because he would have shielded. But like, you, you could have almost killed them, right? And this way you're against the full HP Zarya that I think is getting pocketed, so you should die here. Like, <laughs> I don't know what happens because I haven't watched the VOD, but you should probably, you're probably dead here. Unless you shield and you manage to run away by turrets. Which, by the way, are all destroyed, so I don't know you should be dead. Let's see. Keep keep Okay, never mind. You got her, that's really good. I don't know why their Anna wasn't pocketing, that's their mistake. But then instead of you know putting the shield up to block that soldier that was above you, you decided to once again put a third up. Like you should have all the turrets up at all times, that's important. But when you're in the middle of a fight, do not put turrets up because that slows you down. Actually, it doesn't slow you down. It stops you completely and you're just like standing. So against a good soldier, he's going to left click once in your head and then uh, rocket you and you're dead. So definitely don't do that. I got three charges left. Three charges left. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm in. Three charges. Yes. One so charge left. One charge left. Yeah, close to shatter. <sighs> I will follow. Save my shield, save my shield! Oh, okay. So, when you came to the. Before you even came to the porter, you should have been charging your right click. And the moment you come to the porter and go up the stairs, you should have fired it because, once again, that's something that's free. Like, there's no reason not to do it. Like, you come to the porter, you, you know, let your right click go somewhere near hubs, let's say. And maybe hit someone. Like if it doesn't hit anyone, whatever. Like you can charge it again. But if it hit someone, like you just got someone's HP down to less than half, and you just came from spawn. You know that's why it's free, and you should be doing it no matter what hero it is. But especially with Symmetra, because you know right click, you can have many of them. That. Yeah, so you're really obsessed with the turrets, I get it, but, you know, when you see a pharaoh like that, you should be immediately hiding or putting your shield up, you know, doing anything but stopping to put a turret because that, you know, makes you stand still for a second and you took so much damage. You took 110 damage from her rockets and then you died to Visor. Dead. Slept. Fuck. Far above you guys in cafe. Social link for you. Okay, I'm back right now. I'm pretty close, Shatter. I don't want, I don't want. Am I dead? Yeah, I can play Nano or? Like, you could have probably saved that fight all by yourself if you just survived that and, you know, hid for like two seconds and then killed the Pharah middle level. You know, you go middle level, you shield the, the soldier damage with your shield, and then you kill the Pharah. Even if you don't kill her, she's gonna be like, you know what, like 20 HP or something? She's not gonna be shooting anyone, she's gonna be running away. So, I think you could've won that by yourself, but it just... You stopped for a turret and that fucked you up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah go. Let's There's a soldier in bottom cafe on. Right, 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 right on point! Come on, come on. Okay, one thing I noticed is Lucio and I've watched some other VODs that you've posted. You do not use your wall climbs at all. Most well, we do sometimes when when you know there are fights and you have to get somewhere faster. But 
when you're by yourself, you definitely don't use him. Like, you could have jumped out of spawn, onto the box, and then onto the wall, and then had a triple jump onto the point. You know what I mean? You could have been probably and right in front of the cafe, by the cafe door right now, if you jump three times. So let me show. I don't want, I don't want. Can I dead? Let me show you what I mean. Yeah, I can play right Nano or? And like, I'm pointing this out because on my last team I played Lucio. On the team before that, I played Lucio a lot. But then I switched to, you know, flex, uh, flex support. So it's not like I, I have no idea how to play Lucio or what to do as Lucio. I've played him a bunch. Maybe even more than I've played everything else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah go. There's a soldier in bottom cafe on. Right, right. Okay, so right here. You have so many options, right? Like, this is not optimal, but you can jump here, onto like here somewhere, and then, I don't know, maybe here, and then onto that wall, and then you're there. Or, whoops, what the? F okay. Or, you can, let me go forward a little bit. Run, run, run. Oh, fuck. I, oh my god, that's bad. Yeah, yeah. One try. There's a soldier in bottom cafe on. Right, 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 right on point. Okay, so you do a good jump, but you don't hit it. Like, you have to hit the box on the jump. Oh, if you have to <laughs> hit the jump on the box that's right here. And then boost right onto this wall. And then probably boost somewhere here onto this wall. And then you're at the exit way before the store burn. But, you know, I don't know if you're not focused or you're just not paying attention to it, but that's really important as Lucio, because you can be, you know, end the fight a lot faster than everyone else. And it's overtime, and you should not be... Well, I mean, it's important if Thorpe gets there, but you should be there faster to help the team and help stall, right? That's more important right now. Coming, coming. Dead. I got multiple. Who's dead? Nice. 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 Just nice fucking job, Hey, I was there with you, Hobbs. Right? Me and fucking the down. Uh, the last fight, there's no one. I didn't know the soldier was coming up to my turret. I heard the call. You know, behind the shield, okay, I should have gave you that. I should have gave you that telling. I should have just oh, yeah, watched. Good soldier. Select your hero. Um, I got the telly back. Dive. No, who who died? I know there was one guy that died, and I took the okay. for the. You're not in. Our nap, so I'm good. This is then my sister's like, we need to reset the internet. Five, Fuck you. Four, three, two, one. Yeah, one thing I forgot to mention right at the beginning. Um, so okay. let me just play you. In general, when you play, you want to have your crosshair at the enemy neck level. Like in other games, you want to have it at their head level because headshots are important. But in this game, you want to have it at their neck level. When you run or like do whatever, no matter what character you're playing, I've noticed is you have it way down somewhere in their like chest area. That's just not, that's not optimal, right? You want to start with a headshot. Like once again, that's free. You should be getting it every time. Not the headshot, but you should be getting the neck level aiming every time. Uh, I mean, that that takes, you know, a lot of practice and getting used to, like, if you're not used to it, I guess. I don't know. I hope that makes sense, because it's it's kind of important. Like, especially for Lucio, where, like, you, you think you don't have enough damage, right? But if you start with like at least two headshots then you can actually run to the target you know left click him punch him push him away and then pretty much kill him so starting with headshots is really important keep the keep the crosshair up more a little bit to the neck level like no matter what you're playing no matter what map it also eliminates the need to flick to their head once you see them because you're already at that level right and another thing i don't actually I think you can see your crosshair most of the time. I mean, I can barely see it. I used to play with a dot. I get the idea. I've played with a dot with, in all my games and the dot is important. But 
like if I don't think you can see it. So if you can switch to something else or switch to a different color or something like that, so you can like that way you can see it better and then it can also help you aim at the head level right away. I don't know. I don't know if you want to try this or not, but like one day if you decide, try it, see how it goes and see if it helps you or not. I just know I use the dot for, for, I don't even know how many years, eight or nine, maybe more in different games. And that's all I use because it was really important. But in this game, I switched to the, the um, what is it called? The cross, the green cross, because I can actually see it the whole, all the time and like flicks are even easier because I can actually see what I'm flicking to. So, I mean, if you want, just give it a try someday. Let's go. Capture objective A. What's up, Genji? It's all dropped up. They might have. Alright, never mind, they're not playing Torb. The Alright, let's go. I'm in dirt. Yeah. Alright, get up top. Alright, we're back alley. I'm gonna take HP. Go in place. Alright, three speeding now. You hear that? Lucio on top. Lucio low. I'm gonna Genji. Genji one, Genji one, Genji one. Diva almost on Mac, Diva almost on Mac. Diva's on Mac. Is there one? Is there one? Yeah, I need that. I got, that. I got fucked by the fucking man. Just shot me as I All right, jump. Now let me watch this again. Alright, let's go. Lucio on top. Lucio low. I'm gonna get you. Get you one, get you one, get you one. Get get so I get the idea you want to farm uh, ult off of D.Va, I guess that works, that's fine, but like if it, if this was me playing, I would be right here as the Lucio. Why? Because we have a Winston right here, he's taking all the damage. So you can pretty much come over here and just not only build your ult, but you can actually pick up kills because nobody's looking at you. They have two of their tanks here. Their DPS are, you know, taking care of our DPS, and you just have free reign. So why not? So why not come into their backline, help the Winston, even if they have a Nana, you can actually go for the Nana. Like if you get slept, like fuck, it happens. But not to mention if you get slept, then Anna doesn't have sleep for anyone else. So you know, I don't think you have a like a bad move here if you go into their backline with the Winston. I just think you you can even pick up kills and build your build your ult even faster. That's that's just you know what I think you should be doing instead of shooting the diva. Cause like yeah, shooting the diva is important, but I mean, all their Anna has to do is peek from somewhere and heal her a little bit. But if you're actually right here, you can actually kill someone right away. Cause the Winston is already shooting them, right? Like the Winston is doing most of the damage. All I have to do is like left click once and then punch him and then you probably kill him you can also go behind him oh that's, that's another favorite of mine you can actually go like right while right behind him and push him towards our winston and then he can he can pick up the kills like, you, you can even do that i mean this is a lucio i think so i'm not saying you should put, push the lucio you can do that but like any type of hero you can do that too and it's really good Try that next scrim, see if you diving with uh, everyone else is good because you're not protecting anyone, right? You're not sitting, sitting with an Anna here. You have free reign, so I'd rather have you dealing mo more damage and possibly picking up even kills or helping, helping the rest of our team pick up kills instead of just shooting their D.Va. Can I start this? Nope. Diva on last night, Diva on last night. Diva's on Mac. Is one? Is one? Yeah, I need to know that. I got fucked by the fucking man. Just shot me as I... Yeah, because, you know, nobody helped the Winston a lot. He was pretty much by himself the whole time. If you were there with him, maybe you could have picked up a kill on someone. Alright, jump. Right, but if you need help, let me know. I didn't know that you were back uh, shut down with the soldier. The Diva's still out of mech. By the way, this is 
like all this is about you. I'm trying to help you. I'm not discussing team things. There are many things that you know the team could be doing differently, but I'll try to do a VOD review of, of one of Teddy's VODs because I think that's going to be a lot better. Let's wait up. Who's here? Where is she? Is she in dumpsters? Yeah, I'm gonna die from main. She's just yeah, me running out from main. Spin me out, spin me out. Speedy now. Diving upper, no sleep. Come on, Anna. Are we on? She's, she's half, back out. I lost Diana. So, uh, Lucia one, Lucia one, Lucia one. Ryan, Ryan. Ryan one. Okay, here you kill the Ryan. Well, I mean, you picked up the killer. He was mostly dead, but you know what I mean. And then you go for the D.Va. Uh, you know they have a second healer. I mean, I think they do. They have an Ana, right? They should have an Ana. I'm assuming they have an Ana. So, instead of going for the D.Va... Let me go back a little bit. No, not there. Not here. Okay, right here. Hey, I lost Diana. So, right here. So, right here. Again, I would love for you to help Hubs and get this Lucio right here. Because it's a free kill. He's far away. He can now wall ride. If you left click him and punch him, he's dead. Like, Hubs will pick up the kill. It's a free kill. You should be getting this. Like, after you kill the Ryan, obviously, because, you know, someone called the Ryan, so that's important. But after that, you should be getting this little seal. Let me just run it forward a little bit. So, uh, here, once again, you're on point trying to heal people. That's good. But. If you know they have an Ana, so I'm assuming their Ana is like up here, right? Top cafe. I would love for you to wall ride up top and just basically like, I don't know, contest her so she doesn't heal. Because you're two picks up, even if you're not on point healing people, like they, you should trust them to take care of three people when they do not have heals because you're contesting the Ana. As long as you're contesting the Ana, she's not going to heal anyone. She's going to be fighting you, even using the good Ana on you. So I'd say it's more important to get us to Anna here for free. That's just what I think. But only because you already have two picks. Like if it was a if it was a six on six, I would have said like stay on point and heal. But in this situation, try to get the Anna. Or a soldier. Even if they have a soldier, you can still like wall ride, you know, left click, punch him, push him away, and then the moment he rockets you and brings you down to half HP, just run away. I'm on soldier, soldier cafe. I don't want to, I don't want to. I'm dead. Get you on top. Soldier. Help with soldier. Oh my god. This card even. Soldier. You got him at. Soldier's oh, running out. Nice. That point. He's low though. The soldier might run in, he's pretty close by. He's right here, he's almost dead. Thank you. Ryan ran back inside spawn. You're gonna die. Here, I'm gonna come get you. I'm gonna come get you. I'm fine. Uh, where is everybody? Come here, come here. I just right, right, everybody push up. I just spawned. I just spawned. Guys, are push up with the soldier and you get high ground with them. Okay, so you're up. I have a McCree. You got ult. Let's pull spawn. Fuck Ryan. Let's blade Ryan's out. Ryan's on, Ryan's on. Alright, let's pull spawn and blade. When Debo went, Debo went. Debo went. Or blade. Okay, so here you're just standing still. You're not doing anything. You you could have the tab open the whole time and just this is the moment where the shock collar is needed. Like everyone's fighting except you. You're not doing anything. You're just standing still. Like you can even like get a drink or something. So you can be pressing tab here and deciding what to do next fight and like what else to use or how to push. Like there's so many things you could be doing here. Instead of asking for alts, right? I mean, asking for alts is good. They give you the percentages, but also have the the tab open the whole time and start thinking. Okay, what do we use here? Like, what can we have? Can I send PG like high ground? Can I, uh, you know, make demon uh, use the alt and save the the rest of the alts? Like, uh, these are all questions you should be asking yourself, right? And try to get out if you can. I'm gonna advise right now. Can you put an orb on? Right, I can jump in two. I can jump in two. Ready? I'm in. I'm, 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 I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm not HP. Still stuck. Alright, so instead of you, instead of you calling anything, PG just called him himself. Himself that he's gonna visor. Which I mean, I think it's fine. 
but I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention to the game, so I wasn't paying attention to alts or what they might have. Obviously, they lose you the news ult, so you might have had it since since you're pretty close to it. You're assuming that the enemy Lucio has it, right? So that should come into play when you're thinking about what else to use. You're like, oh, I have my Lucio, then I say the enemy Lucio has this too. So maybe we visor and then let them use a couple of ults and then you blade. Like maybe that's your call right here. Or maybe we blade, we wait for the Lucio ult, and then we visor. You know, stuff like that. Because that's like really important. Like those calls can win you the space right here. Brother one, dead. Brother, Brother. 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 Lucio coming out main. They're all main. Yeah, he survived? Holy shit. Get ready for Zeno. Yeah. So Winston, give our Lucio up. Or Zeno. Winston, Winston, oh, Winston, 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 like Zen should not have been playing there, and then on top of that, you die. Like we cannot be losing both supports like this. Like fine, he made a mistake, but you should be covering for him. Like you should not be dying on top of him. You know what I mean? Like it's a diva ult. What did you die to? Let me see. Oh, you died to diva. Like I don't know. Like you should, I don't think you should be dying here. Let me just see what happened again. I died. Yeah, you're you're in Zen Zolt. You should not be dying to anything at all. I don't know. That, that was kind of weird. So Winston, give our Lucio up. Winston, 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 I died. I do every single. It's just that you should have made the call for people to use absolutely everything here. Like this is really an, an important point. Uh, with the way they got it, they can probably stall you here for the rest of the game. You should have just blew all of the ults. Obviously, Zen ult should not have been used like that, but like it should have been your call. Well, maybe not yours, but like someone should have called to use all ults and like not die here, because that's really important. Right now you died with Lucio ult, you could have actually blocked two of their ults, the Genji Blade and the Soldier ult with your Lucio ult. Using a sword and I got booted, so I died to the bomb. I didn't really lose so many people. They use like... Nano Blade, they use Soldier ult, they use Lucio ult. So many people because they have pearls. Once again here, you should be holding tab the whole time and thinking about what to do. It's like... They use Diva so Bomb. They only have Primal Rage, to be they honest. Have beat, right? We have no, they just, they, they just switched uh, to Monkey. They, they, they don't have about them. Oh, yeah, they, no. they have no ults. They, sure. they don't have it. They used it last fight. They're, the they're, they're far up right. Let's go right. Let's go right. Let's go right. No, just beat me out here. Alright, Speedy now. Oh, this is my jam. What's it I don't sleep. Sumo, lower, lower. Soldier dead. I'm not next. What's it dead? I don't pay I'm dead. I'm dead. Lucio, Lucio one. Diva, Diva, Diva. Diva, Diva. Diva, Diva. Diva, Diva. Genji, Diva. Diva, 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 if I have to be honest, I'm losing in crosshair most of the time here. I don't know how you see it in game, but <laughs> I can't even see it. So I hopefully you can see it in game and you're aiming at the right targets because I can't tell since you know 
I'm losing it most of the time. Don't lose your own 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 Don't lose your like, once again, I mean, I mentioned that twice, but that's really important. Once you get a point, you should be tabbing and, you know, already thinking about the next point. What else they're going to have, what else we have, and what we can run, what else we can use, and any switches if we need to, right? That should be on every, after the capture of every single point. Soldier, 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 soldier. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. I'm with you guys. Gotta take up first. Alright, I'm on point. Listen close. Hey, don't push up to get, high, get high ground and then all oh, on top of uh, top right. But don't, not yet, not yet, when we're all like with you. Hubs is ready, guys. Ooh, also, one thing. We have. So when you go to Discord, you go to user settings. And then you go to. Let's see where it was. You go to notifications. And then you go to PTT activate and PTT deactivate. Just turn those off. Like, you don't have to hear that beeping noise on Discord. It probably, like, nobody else hears it. That's just you. But, you know, it's just clutter that you don't actually need. Unless you're running it on purpose to know that you're... Mic is on? I don't know. But in case you didn't know, that's how you turn it off. Ready, get ready. Let him go, out, let him go. Out. Don't die. Winston is the next to. Uh, Start running, Winston. Start running, Winston. Lush one, Lush one, Lush one, Lush one. Lush dead. Am I here or. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Devo, 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 right there. Monkey up, Lush one, so. We got him back. Monkey one, Monkey one, Monkey one. Monkey Nice. Soldier ulted, red right side. Dead. Standpoint, standpoint. Kill soldier, kill soldier, kill soldier. Is that Lucio? Lucio, Lucio, Lucio. Nice. So Tracer. Tracer. Okay, I don't know what this was. Like, I don't know if you were paying attention or not. But this should never happen, right? Kill soldier, kill soldier. Come on. Standpoint, standpoint. Like, you see there Lucio coming. Like, he's the only one that can come on cart and stop it and contest it. You're the only one on cart. Like, Zen cannot do anything. Like, he's all. And he's running straight towards you. Like, that's a free triple left click into a punch, into a push away. And you get Lucio down to half HP. That's, once again, that's, that's free. You should be doing this the whole time. And even if you manage to like miss everything, you can still push him away so he's not contesting the card most of the time. But I don't know why you're not paying attention to the only thing that's, you know, in front of you. Like you basically let him pre-contest the card this way. Kill soldier, kill soldier, kill soldier. Is that Lucio? Lucio, Lucio, Lucio. So Tracer. Fine. She's left, right side. Here, good. Here you push, you push the tracer away. But I'd say, like, if tracer is so close to you, you had the advantage actually. Like, just triple left click, punch, and you're gonna force a recall. Like, so I'd say when you have a tracer that close to you, just go for the one v one. Don't push away. Obviously, if you're really low, you can do it. But you are full HP, so just take the one v one. There's no reason not to. Like, I'm pointing out all the free things that, you know, can help you win fights, get better, and help the team a lot more. I can hold this. Monkey, 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 I've entry. Monkey one, monkey one, monkey one. Yo, that's it. Can I one? Ah, uh, shit. Keep running, keep running. One soldier. We're... Alright. I'm healing you. Tracer right side, behind. Discorded. Alright. Is that a mech? Is that a mech? She also just get back. We're down. Alright, yep. Run, 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 run. 
PG get high ground when we come back. Chase is pushing up. Front heals. Push up, push up, push up. Mikey goes. Chase the Mikey left side, chase the right behind, chase the behind. Come Mikey, come Mikey. Mikey one, Mikey one, Mikey one. He get, he's got ult. Kill. I suck, I suck Diva. Diva's also one. Alright, don't do Diva first. Winston low. I'm on Ana, Ana far back. Oh, Ana one. Ana dead. Soldier upper. Just push fail for now. Uh, I'm on HP, I'm on HP, I'm on HP. Soldier top, yeah. I can bubble in one. Bubbling? Dead. I'm, he's one. I got no HP. I think you guys got it. Nope. Oh, it's just I have visor here, but I don't want Get top ground. Yeah. High ground. Hello. Let's get back. It's very it's wonderful. Dead. We just get on Almost here, almost here. Let's push with this. Lower. That one's done. Sort of time. Good soldier upper. Everybody's here. Alright, speedy. During the whole time, no matter what you guys are doing, you're not utilizing Lucio's uh, boost off the wall. Like, you can be so annoying and actually get in Anna's face the whole time. But I mean, I get it, you're playing with the team, but even when you're playing with the team, you can still be wall riding and like landing on their heads and landing free headshots, free punches, if you're just using the walls around you. I'm on I'm anti. Tracer, Tracer left side, Tracer left side. She's at mini. Come Mikey, Mikey have HP. Chaser left. Mini mini. Soldier right, soldier right, dead. 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 Evolution. I'm dead. Stuck. This is gonna make you feel better. Chaser. Do I have? Okay. 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 Oh, I'm dead. Point. 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 Listen behind, listen behind. Yeah, let's pick it up. Low. We got this, we got this, we got this. Soldier low, soldier. Soldier one! Here you missed the jump off the wall and then off to the second wall. That couldn't. You, like, you could have landed on the cart. Like, that's free. Should we do this? We got this, we got this, we got this. Soldier low, soldier. Soldier one! So you got one jump and then you missed the second jump off of here. They could have landed you here and you could have been on the cart. Instead, you're in the middle of, you know, way behind your team. And by the time you get there, like, the fight is probably going to be over. You just have to be using those jumps to get to where you need to be a lot faster. Use your ults when you get when you guys get out. Bubbling, bubbling, bubbling on point. Lucio one, Lucio one, Lucio one, Lucio one. Lucio dead? Diva on point, Diva on mech, so. Diva mech, Diva mech, Diva mech. Chase the left side. Chase the left. Gotta kill her. She's low, she's recovering. Like I mentioned here, you don't have to push her away, you can just kill her and force a recall. Recall. Nice. Especially since it's a, you know, 4v1 or 5v1. Like you're actually helping Tracer if you push her away because people are, are aiming at the Tracer and the moment you push her, that fucks up the aim of everyone and then she blinks, that fucks the aim again and then she recalls and then that's how they style the card for so long. Like th those pushes are not needed when it's like 4v1 and they're staggering in. Just get the kills. Maybe if she recalls and has no blinks you can push her away so you can secure the card but otherwise just don't do it. There's no point. Soldier? Yeah. Mikey? Nice. Nice! That was close. Damn. I don't know how they didn't kill me. I fucking walked up and tried to stick the Ana in the middle of their team because I thought the game was over. And then they just like ignored me. Alright, that's, that's gonna be it for today. And... I mean, hopefully that helps you. I think I pointed out a lot of things that you can change that's gonna... improve your gameplay but just you know let me know when you watch it if it helped you at all and if you want me to keep doing this